The Milton real estate market is shifting. If you're buying or selling in Milton, you need to watch this video. February 2022 started out of the gates blazing hot. However, the end of the month did not end the same as it began. We saw the month end with an average home price for all of Milton landing at 1.35 million, up 7.3% over last month and 27% over last February. Towards the end of the month and into the first week of March, we saw the shift in pricing strategies and one size fits all marketing that resulted in 76 terminated or suspended listings, meaning sellers took their house off the market after not selling on offer night and relisted at a higher price or sometimes even lower price to try and reposition themselves amongst the inventory. The competitive advantage of working on a team is that we are representing multiple buyers and sellers at all different price ranges and we have the insight into showing activity and offer numbers. In the last few weeks, showings have decreased by at least 50% and the number of offers received on offer night has gone down as well. Where we were seeing 20 offers on a home, we are now seeing one to three offers. And in some cases, none at all on offer night. But in saying that, the sale prices are still very strong. We're in a strong seller's market. We are still sitting at only half a month of inventory and a balanced market would require four to six months of inventory. We believe the sale prices are more in line with the comparable sales and the days of selling for 200,000 more than the last sale on your street or a similar home seem to be behind us and the market appears to be leveling off. So why is this happening? We believe that there are a few reasons. One, we've already experienced a 10% increase this year in two months. Two would be buyer fatigue. It's not easy repeatedly losing out on homes you love. Three would be interest rate hikes. We just had one announcement with a quarter point increase and more to follow this year. Bear in mind, this is a $13 increase per $100,000 of mortgage and it impacts only variable rate mortgage products. Four, a lot of instability and uncertainty in the world that may cause some people to pause their plans. We believe all of this can impact the psychology of real estate, which may take some people out of the market or looking to different areas. The data continues to show that prices remain consistently strong in Milton. If you are thinking of selling, you need to know that in a shifting market like this, you must price your property according to current market conditions. When we pick our final MLS pricing strategy with our sellers, we consult with them hours before going to the MLS. So they are getting real time market data and are able to make confident, educated decisions. If you're a buyer, you may also feel some confusion with asking prices because you're going to see some homes listed very low and not holding offers some holding off on offers, and some with a 24 to 48 hour irrevocable, and some listed high and not holding at all, and others that have been on the market for weeks at multiple different prices. You'd be doing yourself a disservice by not having proper guidance and advice in this market. You could be overpaying significantly when you really don't need to be. Overall, the market is still very healthy, and if done properly, you will still have incredible results. The main shift we are seeing is in your pricing strategy. Understanding these market shifts is your competitive advantage. As full-time realtors who live and work in the communities that we service, we are privy to these market changes in real time. If you have questions about the market and how it affects you, book a consultation with us below using the Calendly link. Whether you're buying or selling, or you just want to have a discussion about real estate in Halton, we are happy to help. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you next week.